Okay, everybody, it's the holiday, it means I have today off. So, guess what day it is? It's Barn Day! In case you don't know who I am, my name is Dawn and I work here at FX Capera Harley Davidson. We are out here at the Perch River Wildlife Management Area. It's a long way between my house and the barn, so turning you on about halfway. Huh? <laughs> Sorry. Let's finish the trip for this holiday ride. Now, today is Monday, May 25th. If all goes according to plan, you will be seeing this closer to the 4th of July holiday. So that's why this is a holiday special. We have a big, beautiful country. And it is really best to see it by motorcycle if you can. Oh, that was a bump. They weren't lying. So, most of my holidays... And most of my days off, at least half of them anyways, I try and go out to the barn. When I was a kid, I was horse crazy. When I was 12, my mom finally relented and let me go to horse camp. And from there, I got a job working at the ranch in San Jose with Buck Nord Ranch. And from there I started showing and then eventually I began teaching before going to college then met and married my husband he joined the army he was stationed in Germany which is like the ah, Mecca. So I learned German just so I could take horseback riding lessons over there. Had an absolute blast. And then my husband got stationed over here at Fort Drum. And doing research of the area is how I met Margie where my horse is now at. I've heard people say, oh, when you're riding your motorcycle, it looks like you never move. Well, that's another discipline that's brought forth from horses. Yeah, the horse is doing all the work as well as the rider, but the rider makes it look effortless. Like I'm just sitting here, which it with Harley Davidson is actually the truth. They're so well balanced. It's very easy to ride. And I suspect in a way, Horses are one of the reasons I ride a motorcycle. At the ranch, we had a couple of dirt bikes to check the fences. So I started riding those. I was like, wow, this is a lot of fun. <laughs> this is like that feeling that I get jumping a horse over a fence. You know, it's like, woo! I think it's very easy for women especially who have that connection with horses very easy for them to move into a connection with motorcycles because it's almost that same ah, it's a stress release it's the ah moment so original horsepower or iron horsepower a pause to say thank you that I can enjoy both in the same day. <laughs> oh, somebody got new stone. There's Margie. I brought the camera for the baby.
Oh, what a little princess. Were you not housekeeping? Two weeks later. Look at a tail flip. It's like, I want that. I want that. I want that. No. <laughs> oh my goodness. driveways. You really want to get to know your bike, you get on a dra gravel driveway <laughs> and try not to dump it. It's so pretty out here. Check out Margie. Yep, she's back there still. to be the home of Vigo Mortensen's aunt, I believe. Ready when you are, brother. Let her back. Who used to live there? Jane Logan. Jane Logan. Yeah, yeah. Uh, she was something else. She was. She was a pep. Let's see if this little building's up here still. Oh, yep, there it is. Like a little, just like a little one room church, I think. One of the reasons I love this road.
working for Harley Davidson of Atlanta down there. And they had what was then called the Rider's Edge course. Took the course, passed the class, got the M endorsement, got my own bike. So I am very, very, very blessed for this in this life and I try not to take anything for granted. It is such a joy to have friends like her, have friends that I work with at the shop, have friends in Atlanta, and now, thanks to the internet, have friends all across the world who love to ride. the merrier for sure so look me up connect and we'll share writing stories I'm gonna turn left up here and go home she's gonna go on into Watertown sure to give me a thumbs up. You need to pay attention to what I'm doing. There we go. If you want to see more, please hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Thank you again for watching. And until the next time, guys. Oh.